today I'd like to just tell you a little bit about our new BG range. It's new exciting rods that have just come out. Um, currently there's only three that we have available in it. It is the spinning, the popping and the jigging. The first one that I'd like to talk about is our spinning one. Weight wise it's 14 to 28 grams. It's ideal for the pedal ski guys that are trying to catch snook. It's very long, very light. It's a 7 foot 6. Um, it comes with stainless steel guides in it. It is phenomenally good and durable for paddle skis. It takes a beating. They are slightly flexible. Um, it's a long thin rod or thin blank. It comes with Fuji winch, so it's good quality. Um, long butt, it has got the gimbal at the bottom, so it does not rotate around in your paddle ski or ski boat or jet ski for that matter. That's basically the first one. The second one is going to be our popping rod. It's slightly longer. It's 84 to 140 grams as far as casting weight goes. This one here is an 8 foot 6. Um, a lot stiffer than our previous spinning one. Again, Fuji winch, gimbal at the back, um, two piece. Nice for transporting purposes, nice for storing away in your paddle ski before you get out. Next one. This is our jigging rod. Basically it goes up to 150 grams as far as jig weights go. Once again, it is stainless steel guides, butt cap for the guys that are actually jigging. Once you've hooked the fish, it allows the rod not to twist, or basically prevents the rod from twisting. It matches up nicely with our 5,000 or 4,500 BG range of reels. Um, this rod, being a jigging rod, basically comes apart, as you can see over there. Uh, once again, it's better for transporting purposes. Very thin, very sensitive rod. These guys are absolutely phenomenal as far as braid friendly goes. Um, it's an easy maintenance free rod. You basically take it outside, you spray it off and you carry on fishing the next day with it. There is nothing that can actually go wrong with this rod whatsoever. It's got the perfect action for light jigging. Uh, like I said, it goes up to 140, but a 90 gram jig for our conditions where we're fishing very shallow, this is the, the rod that I'd recommend that you look at, 90 gram jig, squiddy jig, anything along those lines. You'll find that most of the bigger heavy duty um, jigging rods that are on the market are a lot thicker, a lot heavier, and basically, value for money, this is one of the better rods on the market today and like I said cosmetically matched with the BG it is absolutely phenomenal this is one of the better rods as far as quality goes it's light it's durable um, for our paddle ski fishing uh, guys that we have most of them do not fish in excess of 40 meters of water so if you're off at Mozambique where you're fishing in shallow water a lighter rod basically helps you a lot more. You can also double up as a casting and popping rod, although it is quite stiff. This gentleman is our anchovy spoon. Uh, it came out last year in the height of our snook season. Um, this is the 50 gram that I'm holding here at the moment, but you get it all the way from a 5 gram all the way through. There's six or seven different variations of it. Our Natal boys have been doing extremely well, especially with the 50 gram for the tuna of Durban and uh, the guys that are fishing for Kuta up in Mozambique absolutely are going bossies about this little lure. Uh... Lately I've heard through a couple of my friends that are down there that are fishing on the quiet that they're taking the anchovy spoon, they're taking the, the single hook off, putting a small assist hook on the top and they're jigging for albacore or yellowtail and that match this rod will be a phenomenal outfit. I must have sold about six or seven of these in the last week alone. This anchovy spoon 
in particular the 50 gram has been caning the fish on the north coast. The guys have been throwing it off the beach, catching a lot of kingfish or GTs as they're better known. Um, the guys off the beaches, off the crances, places like that down in the Cape have also been catching a lot of yellowtail throwing this little spoon at them from the beach. It's a phenomenal casting spoon.